So guys, the last time I reviewed Oxygen OS on my Redmi Note 5 Pro, it was Oreo. But the next update, this one is 5 from the OnePlus 6. So let's start with the review and installation. So guys, this is the Oxygen OS from OnePlus 6 and it's based on Android Auto Pi. So into about phone, you can see it says Snapdragon 845, dual camera, the adaptive camera, all OnePlus 6 features. Now this is the Oxygen OS version 9.0.2 and this is the Android version. I can see it has a derp kernel 3.9 so you can see android version and i don't know why the oems which give the december or the november update doesn't have that feature let's check again or if it's some mistake by my side check on android 9 and yeah i don't know why this oems give this updates and that we don't get an animation but yes it's 9.5 this is the oneplus 6 launcher from android pi and it looks really good here we have this uh, uh, what they say uh, maybe some assistant menu or something but yeah the right memo toolbox and decent apps and stuff then into the settings of launcher you can see we have these options add icon to home swipe down shelf yeah this is a shelf uh, this thing it's called as shelf and you can also disable it from here if you don't want and we have double top to lock notification icons icon pack and home screen layout you can see this has g apps included and a lot of options are available let's move into settings let's take a look at the ui and you can see this is the settings ui from android pi for the oneplus 6 and it looks really good like on our readme note 5 pro now let's go into display option you can see we have sleep night mode ready mode screen calibration notch display and if you want to like take it like this is how it looks really ugly because we don't have the notch then you have ambient display and this doesn't work then wallpapers from the one plus six the new one and we have the theme light or dark so for me uh, light and dark both looks good so it's upon the user and how the user experience he wants you can see this is dark and everything turns dark now this is actually great like everything turns dark and it looks good also it will save battery on our redmi 5 uh, redmi note 5 so yeah this thing is good we have notifications blink light accent color the status bar and all other stuff yeah that stuff is available everywhere then buttons and gestures navigation bar and gestures let's take a look at the navigation gestures do they work oh my god they are working really fine oh this is how they get to the back maybe and yes everything is working really fine so yeah maybe i'll play them for a while but then i'll be again back to my pie gestures and also we have the back end home okay so this is how it is like how they have the it. yeah this one's great then we have battery you can see the battery ui the battery interface then we have storage storage interface it's it's the same it's not something new. Then you have the utilities and you can just check this parallel apps, gaming mode, app locker, schedule power on off and pocket board. Now not all of the features are working. I'll list down all of the bugs down below but it's yeah it's cool and it's stable as a daily driver. But some bugs maybe you don't want like all of them are in the description so you can check it down below. And also we have the camera from the OnePlus 6 so you can see it clicks pictures and portrait mode and panorama maybe is a... A bug so you can see front selfies so yeah selfies are coming that's great and also the normal pictures then we have this gallery app and this uh, contacts so you can see other apps looks really good you can take a look at all of them but now it's time for the installation and that's it for the review let's start with the installation with the power of finger device now just boot into the TWRP recovery using the power button and volume button and yes, the OnePlus reboot and all stuff is broken, so be careful with the reboot and stuff. Then go to wipe. You need to wipe your older ROM, so these are the options you need to select. I'm on the official recovery, so don't worry, I haven't any modded recovery or some black modding recovery. And into here, we have these two options. Now, the Mac OS P VND guy, which is the vendor, is not uh, like always it's compulsory or something if you don't flash this mac osp you will get the voltage icon but not deep sleep so i will suggest you guys to flash this voltage icon is not necessary like the calls are working but why voltage icon is necessary but we uh, like the deep sleep is necessary 
just flash these two and guys the device auto rebooted without my notice and now you can see it's on the oneplus boot animation and this is how to install oxygen os pi on a redmi note 5 pro so i hope you guys have liked this video and if you guys like this video press the like button if not the dislike button subscribe for more videos and i'll see you guys in the next video for the redmi note 5 or the redmi note 5 pro or the redmi 5 plus or any other device so bye bye and enjoy oxygen os pi bye bye